It was a coordinated attack intended to kill us, or failing that, put us out of commission for an extended period. Obviously the first step of a larger scheme, something that we would stop. The attacks were strategically brilliant. More than that, they were specifically targeted at our physical and psychological weaknesses. Obviously by someone who knows us very well. The plans were mine. Yours? Say what now? Yours? I've carefully studied every Justice Leaguer, past and present, and created contingency plans to neutralize you, should that ever become necessary. You've gotta How be kidding me with that. Neutralize, not kill. Whoever implemented my plans altered them. It's still a completely unacceptable breach of our trust. The members of the Justice League are among the most powerful and potentially dangerous people on the planet. You think one of us would go over to the other side? Or succumb to mind control? Yes, it's possible. That's why I developed plans for containing any or all members of the JLA, should the need ever arise. None of us would ever do that to you. Then you're damn fools. Where do you think you're going? I'm just a visitor. This is getting personal. Stay. You're part of this now. I'm not sure I have a problem with Batman's contingency plans. But letting somebody steal them was pretty damn dumb. To us during the Vandal Savage matter, we have to decide whether Batman should be allowed to remain in the League. All those in favor of- Wait. Before we vote, I think the accused should be allowed a few words in his defense. Seconded. Okay. Batman? My actions don't require any defense. In the same situation, I do it again. Oh, come on! As individuals, and even more so as a group, the Justice League is far too dangerous to lack a failsafe against any possible misuse of our power. We use our power to protect the world. We always have. And what if we ever used it for some other purpose? If you people can't see the potential danger of an out-of-control Justice League, I don't need to wait for a vote. I don't belong here. What do you want? You made contingency plans to stop everybody in the League just in case any one of us ever went bad. My contingencies were intended to immobilize, not kill. But Savage came up with a plan to bury you. I assume so. It wasn't one of mine. Was that it? With all that talk about unchecked power, you're still so arrogant you didn't bother to come up with a plan to stop yourself. I do have a plan. It's called the Justice League. Just wanted to be sure. What is it? If the League ever did go over to the wrong side, I want there to be somebody I can trust to keep the planet safe. Even from me. Here on Earth, our ongoing struggle with metahuman trafficking has... Struggle? Try disaster. Teens and even kids are being abducted on an unprecedented scale. They're tested for the metagene, and if they test positive, they're used as guinea pigs to create new metahumans. And even if they test negative, they're rarely seen again. Metahumans are being treated as the next exploitable resource by first world countries, Third world countries, rogue nations, corporations, it's a global pandemic. And globally, we are faced with obstacles at every turn. United Nations Secretary General Lex Luthor is using our UN Charter to place more and more restrictions on the League. We have to assume he's working behind the scenes to turn other nations against us. He's hamstrung us! I mean, come on! When that tsunami hit Malaysia, we couldn't even go in on a humanitarian mission. We've become removed. 
distant from the people the League was created to serve. Not by choice. Perhaps it's time to acknowledge that the League has outlived its usefulness on Earth. Batman. That's overstating things, don't you think? No, I don't. And I'm offering an alternative. If your alternative is to disband the League, I think you are forgetting all of the good we do. Did. Past tense. Present tense. The League has its difficulties. I acknowledge that. But we still have a positive impact. And we are an important symbol for truth and justice worldwide. Calder, symbols are great, but... But all that matters is the mission. And if the UN's a roadblock to that mission, then we remove it by removing the League. Bruce, please. You are a founding member. I'm sorry. But I hereby tender my resignation to the Justice League. So do I. Ollie! This was a plan. You, Batman, and the others. You arranged this in advance. You should leave with us, Dinah. We can do a lot of good this way. Well, you're off to a fine start. You knew I wouldn't be part of Blindside and Calder, so you kept me out of the loop. I... If you're leaving, leave. I swear I wasn't a part of this, but I came here today to resign in person. I felt I owed you and the League that much. It's just... I can't do this anymore. I'm sorry. I understand. We... will have to issue a statement. You mean disown them? Yes. So the League will not be held responsible for its former members' actions. It's time. Time? Time for what? Recognize green arrow zero. Robin, eight, uh, Tim, spoiler, where are you going? Three, two, eight. Arrowette, B, two, seven. Robin, B. Join us, Jeff. I think we want the same things. The same things? Really? <laughs> Batman, I just resigned from the Justice League. And at least their leaders were elected democratically. I want nothing to do with them. Batman Incorporated. The truth is, I don't trust you. Especially after what you pulled in there today. What? What did he pull? I'm sorry, Virgil. Maybe you can find a new mentor. One who's less damaged. Will someone please tell me what's going on? Black Lightning. Two, three. Perhaps Dick had the right idea. <laughs> 